Kevlar gloves, but okay, so there's one cut. There's another cut under the, the caudal fence. And those cuts come together right there. Uh, flip the fish over and do those same cuts on the other side. So you can see them again, that same cut. In along the backbone, like this, I'm sliding the knife along the fish bones, like that. I can feel the bones with the knife, I'm sliding them along the fish bones. And I'll cut all the way up to the head here and down to the backbone in the middle of the fish. I cut this way, and I'll slip it across and I cut underneath. Somebody borrowed my fillet knife, so I'm having a little bit of difficulty with this. And I'm not cutting off the end now. That strip of the So here again, cut this. Is that a male or a female? This is this is a female. She has a crossway slit right here. That's her overfore. Yeah, I'm gonna show you guys during the breeding which we're gonna do right after this. I cut all the way up this stomach and mat meet that cut right there. Make sure I go in here. I'm not gonna take that fillet off next because that's that's going to make it almost impossible for me to cut this side. So I'll go in here, I'll make the same two cuts on this. Notice the fish is pretty flat, still. Pretty flat, pretty easy to work on. Same cut here, go across, but not cut off. I'll make the same cut down. Now this is why I left that little bit of skin on okay? now, I didn't do a really great job here. You can see this huge chunk of meat that I missed. But we can take that off like that. Tilapia makes excellent sashimi, by the way. It's pretty much, it's pretty much like yellowtail. for this. You slip it in here and you take these belly bones out. I think, yeah. Okay. This is why they make filet nuts. No, somebody took it out of the kitchen. It's just gone. Uh, oh, you think I'm taking the copper for cutting stuff? I can get to go check the uh, It's a wood-handled knife with a small, long, skinny blade. Oh, yeah. oh great. Okay, we'll fillet the next fish with the right kind of knife. Thanks, Rod. Okay. And now, I've got the knife flat 